one special person who willingly commits themselves to us. Of the millions of people on this planet, how can a woman be expected to find Mr. Right? Unfortunately, we hear stories every day that tell us that many women make the wrong choice. They start out deeply in love, filled with hope and the expectation of a lasting marriage, and end up painfully disappointed and disillusioned. And don't forget, to her groom, a bride starts out as Miss Wright. It takes two to make or break a marriage. Some of us experience the misery of our own parents' divorce and wonder, how can we increase our chances of achieving God's great plan for a harmonious family life? The answer lies in finding a partner whose life is committed to God first. A man who recognizes that a solid marriage includes a third person, 
Jesus Christ and understands the potential for a love that truly knows no barriers to fulfillment. Choosing a mate can't be done hastily. You may be able to think of a friend or relative who barely having experienced the spark of a new love was sending out wedding invitations. Take your time. Proverbs 13.12 says, Hope deferred makes the heart sick. We know that waiting is hard, but believing while waiting is harder still. We have to keep telling ourselves in God's time and learn to be patient and trusting. We need to continue to pray and ask God for His guidance. O oh Lord, I have found someone who seems to be the answer to my prayers. He is my best friend, kind, compassionate, and loving. He listens to me and respects my thoughts and feelings. He knows your word, Lord, and shares my hopes for a lifelong commitment to you and to each other. Open my eyes, Lord, that I may see if he is the one for me. I trust you. When you have waited on the Lord and are sure the man you have fallen in love with was hand-picked by God, you can be sure it will be a lifelong relationship built on the right foundation.